Finally, finally, finally! So of course we're back with another really quick Duck em Out video, so yeah. I'm kidding though. I'm gonna say, like, yeah, but whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever! But yeah, we did get some new info, of course, for JP. We did get the new, of course, Kefla Doga Fest, um, Easy A, not Doga Fest. She's a sub Easy A. I keep forgetting about that. I, I get all of them confused because they all pretty much look the same. Not being Dragon Ball, of course, you know, they are word, but of course, though, like I said, um, yeah, they always say that a lot of times, a lot of times, though. But yeah, we did get some new info for her, of course, though, the full Easy info, all that stuff. I have not gone over her at all. I see her literal skill. It's, um, Pretty simple and easy though, but again, I'm not gonna spoil it for you guys. Get wait until I get the full breakdown. I was gonna do this, and I, and I was gonna originally do like the um, easy area videos. Like oh, I got too much to do today. Now like oh yeah, I only got a couple to do. And then tonight for Gold Boy, I got to do Go Hunt info video for him doing his. Um, of course, tonight times recording, I do have Go Hunt, um, Angel Go Hunt. By the time this goes up, that video will be way up by now. Um, Go Hunt, the Angel Go Hunt from the. I'm trying to think of it. From the Garlic Jr. filler arc from Dragon Ball Z, um, that he'll be up as well, like available and stuff like that. So, um, he's doing and stuff like that will be up, and I gotta make a video for that for his campaign specifically. I might do it for mobile though, it's been a good minute. I don't know, I just kind of feel like I really want to. And the, I don't have a go on, like, because half the time I don't do it on mobile because I literally do not have like, a layout ready. I, I, I have a layout ready for pretty much almost every and anything. Hope you guys see them all. They're all from like, I think, um, the Saiyan Warrior or like Saiyan, I'm more like, um, Zasuke or like um a couple of people I um like they uh, they do like layouts for free and it's like okay I'll take some um just like to get their word out get the stuff out because they actually all look really good um yeah from my videos and stuff like that they all they all actually look really good it's just like oh my gosh like I'm sorry guys like I will put this layout here that layout but I don't think I have a I have a Gohan and Bojack one ready, but it doesn't really make a sense though, so yeah. But of course, like I said, Kefla's info, of course, is here and stuff like that. Don't need to um, explain that much, but um, there actually is a couple little things. The Count Glue Foot Easy A, the Super Saiyan 2 Khalifa, and of course, the Kale Easy A are now available permanently. I believe they are, I think they originally were going to be permanently um, back in like last year or the year before last year for Canada Bio 2020. For some odd reason, they did not keep it the same. I don't know why they did that, but um, yeah. Um, it is permanently available now. Again, Kefla's Easy A is now a part of it. No, I don't really scroll down that much. Because it just goes over Kefla's Easy A. It's been fully added there and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, it's pretty good there. It's really like this, this, this Easy A screen down there. So, I uh, don't need to uh, stretch stuff out or whatever, though. She does not have Easy A summon, though. Um, it'd be cool if they had one. They have Berserker Kale, Berserker, um, Khalifa, then, of course, like, you no, know, Berserker Kale, um, then, <clears throat> sorry, that's not enough. Um, Berserker Kale, um, Khalifa, then, um, of course, like I said, um, um, Kefla, it'd be cool they all have a summon together, but Ke Khalifa and Kefla have like a Doka Fest and about that already, yep, so that definitely, um, does make sense, though, of course, but yeah, she's weak, still weak against Web Universe 7, I also go over it for, like, the old players, because a lot of people don't know what to do, but it's easy, it's actually really easy, though, you don't need to stress yourself out about it, uh, again, Web Universe 7, I don't know, Universal, Surv Universal, Survival Saga, however you want to pronounce or go through it or whatever, um, yeah, it's all pretty simple and pretty easy, like I said, though, um, but yeah, um, again, the easy A medals are a little bit different though, because you need both Kill and Cleveland's easy A medals. Um, for the easy A and stuff like that, of course. Um, but yeah, again, just a little, little crazy stuff like that. Like I said, you need a lot of medals though. Um, if you're combining, if you haven't done like the Kim Cliff easy at all, you're gonna need a lot of those medals because you can easily go back in the stage, you can easily just do the medals and stuff like that. Like, you know, there'll be like a couple of stamina and like, but it does take a lot longer to get the medals though. So if you want to kind of combine and get them all done like one go, this is all your, this is your probably like your best bet and stuff like that right here. But again, it takes both Kill and Cliff medals and stuff like that though. But yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I, I saw that now. So yeah, not like both because they're a few together because they would have. Rotate like Kale, Cleef, and Kepler. Order, but no. It makes sense. That's weird because Berserk Kale's on here and it doesn't really make sense, but okay. Um, but yeah. Um, of course, like I said, it does take Kale and Cliff of Metals 15 um, from each one, 20 for silver, each one gold, 12, and of course, rainbow. Um, again, um, gold and silver pretty much the same for 12. Um, like I said, um, um, so I say gold and rainbow are both 12 wallets no matter what. 15 for bronze, of course 24 on silver. You can all easy rewards are all the same though. You haven't gone through it and stuff like that. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Like I said, you get ADL orbs, physical orbs, all that stuff. I will probably link my original video somewhere around here because I think I did one for both Cobalt and JP. I don't know if I did or not. I can't remember because I, I, this is why I kind of like don't really double dip like that because it kind of, it's the same video pretty much, but it's like, it's some of it's like here and there, some of it's not here or there. It's it's really weird to kind of go and go over that though. A little bit weird, a little bit crazy though, but I'll try to do the best I can though. Um, but yeah, or I but um, I but 
Um, it'll be somewhere like up there as well. I have about views like right here before the video starts or whatever. Like, check out your other video. <laughs> but yeah. Um, of course, this is the summon right here on the Bonds of Friendship summon that comes out with the. I came out with Kill Quiz one and stuff like that, but I feel like that kind of goes with the banner. Um, but yeah, I'm on it. I just kind of brought it up because I'm so used to doing the easy. It's like, oh yeah, they're weak against this, but no. It'd be cool they were weak against Bonds against Friendship if Kefla probably came out, but I. Because I think. Yeah, because all the, all, all of the sub easy have gotten, like, you know, like, they just use the other old Dokken Fest medals or whatever medals they used to awaken the previous unit. Yeah, but for Kefla, I think she is the first one to do this, though, because she doesn't have her own, like, sub easy kind of thing. So it's more like Rose and, like, Vigil Blue and stuff like that. It makes it they are Dokken Fest, though. But Kim Cliff aren't. It's weird. It's like, it goes back and forth. It's weird and stuff like that. We can talk about it in other videos and stuff like that, of course. This is a representative for seven category again. It's got so much buff since January through like what January, February, and March, and then we just got some more stuff with Tournament of Power. But um, yeah, again, it's weird because we just had like you know th last year was like basically Tournament of Power, Tournament of Power, Tournament of Power, Tournament of Power, and like um, um last year yeah Tournament of Power, Universe of Survival Saga, all that stuff. Um, yeah, that was mainly last year. Again, in a little bit 2019. Yeah, yeah, this team is just insane. You could just pretty much run almost any of all these units. Again, the, even the easy age is really easy though if you run like a, that team. Again, you could take a little bit more damage if it's like a not a Zuni or seven unit though. But this team has gotten insane in like the last year already though. So I don't think they really stretch yourself out or go too crazy. This team is already insane. Trust me, it's already insane. Going everything above and beyond though. So yeah, pretty good stuff. Of course. On to, of course, Kefla. Yeah, I've never heard info at all. Yeah, I'm really excited to go through info. Let's get it started. Of course, yeah. Oh, um, she does. Oh, oh, idiot. By the way, I'm gonna be here. I'm just a complete idiot. Oh, okay, so, so, um, I'm still laughing about so, because all my friends watch my videos too, and they're like, "Oh my gosh, dude!" They they just like die laughing every time. Uh, so they do, um, of course, for Kefla. Her circle effect kind of does suck a little bit because it's like right here. This candy cane swirl. Candy doesn't mean like swirl. It's only this stuff. But it would be good to have like an aura because he kind of does. But yeah. Okay, honestly, her own strength probably. Okay, let's go does, of course. Um, target category key three, everything up one. 160. Again, great little skill. Again, all the, like the sub EZAs and stuff like that have been having this. Again, you have Goku category. Again, all the category EZAs seem like they're going to have a little bit of buff. Sadly, Rose and Vegeta Blue did not get one. It's just the, just poor little skills at the time when they came out. It wasn't poor, but when the time they came out, they had the best little skills in the game for heroes and villains. That definitely does make sense. But overall, though, um, again, those little skills are, they're not like, the you know, easy little skills are never really good. But basically, easy areas. Those things just suck because they're just awakening. Old units have been on the game for like five years, six years now. But um, yeah, though um, try to think of it. Um, yeah, again, little skills and stuff like that have been all pretty much the same and stuff like that, of course. But um, yeah, again, just a lot of just different like stuff going on, crazy. Oh, so she definitely attacks defense because that basically raises defense. Immense damage and rare lowers defense. Again, that is insane. Um, I do have my Kefla build. I don't think I'm gonna to my Kefla. My super saint Kefla right here. So, um. When I get duped, I think I think I have like one. I think I gotta go back and check my account later. I'm probably do the video and stuff like that, of course. Um, but her passive, um, again, uh, they don't really need to use that much for the passive and stuff like that because they're already pretty much working before. They don't really need to go like above and beyond. She just into physical orbs, of course, attack physical 20% per um orbitain, medium chance of bidding enemies attack, including super attack. Oh crap, man, the cops coming for me. I just said the leader skill was okay. Come on, man, please. <laughs> oh crap. I got a couple of sounds like, holy crap, man. I just, I just did the lyric skill. That was it. Holy crap. Um, <laughs> if any enemies attack, including super attacks, a much additional, um, a much additional attack, which has the chance of becoming a super attack, plus additional attack, um, plus 60% when they're, when they're attacking, six or more physical orbs obtained. Okay, that kind of does make sense, because that's kind of like, um, the Berserker Kale's kind of like, um, thing down there. And of course, changing orbs and stuff like that. She's, I think, a double orb changer, though, so. No, 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 she isn't. But I think when she first came out, she was kind of like, you know, changing a lot into physical. Really good for like nuking events, like the punch bag machine event, if you have not done that at all. But again, like I said, they didn't really change that much of her. She did this pretty much already before, though. Um, but again, like, um, I was just kidding. I was just kidding outside. I was just kidding. But yeah, um, like I said, though, um, go ahead, face cam. Just, okay, whatever. I don't even try to fix it later. Whatever. But yeah, um, yeah, though, um, again, they didn't really need to change that much before. She was already pretty much good before anyway, though. But yeah, she seems pretty good, though, um, like I said. Um, pretty good. Um, again, they didn't really change that much of her before. Just changing orbs and stuff like that pretty much said the same. Again, it's category easy A. Not really need that much. And she came out, oh, 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 the card shows that. 
She came out on JP, like, oh yeah, because her and Gwen Kuka came out at the same time, pretty much. And I think she came out, but I think her... I think it was, it was usually, like, The Awakening or whenever, when it came out. Yeah, I just noticed that. Holy crap. 2018. Don't go when she came out, like, what, March, April, May? Like, two months later for Cobra. I remember a lot of people freaked out when she came out. Everybody was like, oh my gosh, we got Kepler in the game! <laughs> um, but yeah. Going on about that and stuff like that. But yeah, um, again, um, really good. Again, great little skill, great, um, again, passive pretty much the same as before, just a little bit updated. And, um, and for defense and stuff like that, um, pretty good. Again, if the second defense is insane, again, probably the best guitar leader in the game. I could pretty much kind of say that, though, of course. But yeah, pretty good, pretty simple. I like it. Again, didn't need to change that much. Pretty good, though. But yeah, pretty much could go ahead and end the video up there. Like I said, I didn't really need to go over too much or go too crazy about her EZA. But yeah, again, I love doing EZA videos. It's super short. I could go over the unit, react over. But again, like I said, the leader skills are pretty much always good. Again, EZA areas, ones are usually fodder because they'll have those are just. Um, units had to get really, really, really old awakenings from like five, four years ago. From the, like the beginning of the game, those don't really count. But they have picked those leader skills, uh, tweaked up a little bit though. But yeah, of course, all the batar, like all the category leader skills are gonna be really good. Again, it's really just leader skill. Passive doesn't change that much. And of course, get a little bit of a different essay effect. That's pretty much how all they've been going. You gotta go because they just went all out for him. Because he did pretty much suck. He ate his valley. His damage wasn't good. I mean, his, when he transformed, it was good, but he only dodged a couple of turns. He just does that now, but way a lot better anyway though. So yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the video there for sure, though. Pretty good, easy, simple, easy. Hopefully, you guys can get done pretty fast. Again, I like to do it usually kind of like uh, back in the day when I started doing Dokken like this. I did everything day one. Just to kind of get dinner over with and, you know, before the camping ends. It's like, okay, I can just kind of, you know, relax and stuff like that. But, ah, uh, but yeah, pretty much going to go ahead and end there. See you guys later, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Grab that phone, quick, Make sure you stay safe. Wash your hands. God bless all of you. If you're going out, putting wear a mask, some toilet paper if you really need to. Get vaccinated. All that stuff, because when you hands, I wash your hands in the bathroom. Don't throw that toilet paper in the bathroom. I'll see y'all with them dirty, crazy hands. Oh, my throat. <clears throat> oh. Some of that my throat gave out a little bit. So, we got to think about all this info, though. Of course, you like, you hate it. Gonna go ahead and end it. Uh, why do you saying that? Um. I do like Kepler though, I like how she is and stuff like that. Again, it does take Kel and Caligula Metal to get her done. And it may take a little bit of a while because you gotta go to I mean it's both like pretty much done in one stage though, but they gotta go back and forth. It might take a little bit of a while though, but maybe a couple more hours. Maybe like an hour or two you'll probably get her done, maybe like a couple minutes or whatever, however you wanna go. Probably not a couple of minutes, probably like an hour or two. Because you just gotta go through all that stuff though. But yeah, break up a couple, she's simple, easy, straight to the point, all that stuff, of course. We can stats build up and all that. Yeah, talk about her probably in a different video or whatever. So yeah, see you guys later though, we can know. Peace out.